morning, welcome to Sheni B'chamishi. Standing outside the University of Life. Hehorim v'ag boys. So, beautiful story. Uh, we went as, uh, you know, Lubavitcher boys, we're, with the Tversky, we're visiting the Rachmas Rivke Chatzar. So these Tversky boys, Chaim Eliezer, older brother David Meir, and the older, oldest brother was Shnei Zalman. So they're visiting the Rachmas Rivke. Now, these guys are, how do you look at it? And, 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 and we went to visit the Chatzar of the, of the Rachmas Rivke Rebbe. And the Rebbe is getting old, and you know, there's who's next in line. So they're looking at the boys, and they're saying, look, your father became a chassid, he gave up, uh, he gave up royalty to be, a, to be a servant somewhere else. So, he, so it doesn't look good, and that part of the story doesn't look good, because it's like Hagar went to Avram. So, you know, how Jesse Jacobson says, at the end of the, at the, end of the show, everybody bows, the villains, the, the, every, all the actors bow. So where does it put them in the story? Are they the, the royalty of Hagar's family that she gave up? So they said, your father, Mustam, is a masochist. You know, they had to explain it. Because why would he go and give up something good to be a, 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 a servant somewhere else? But then they told the grandkids, you guys come back to the MS. And uh, you'll be, you know, you'll be, you'll be royalty. It's a very interesting story because you're asking not someone should, in the religion, usually it's made for followers. It's not made for leaders. You understand? The Lubavitcher Rebbe made a system for leaders, to make leaders, not to make followers. So, but in general, religion is made for followers. It's, that's what it's designed for. So, it's not designed for scientists. So, they're telling him... Do tshuva because uh, to come back to do what? To be royalty. It's a genius, amazing story. Shalom. It's, it's something, you know, it's a story of a chatzer that is so interesting in, in the history of chassidism. It's amazing. Because here you're not telling someone you're a traitor and uh, you're having it good now, but you will be punished later which is a very common thing in theology. Here they're telling him, you're a servant somewhere else, come back to the MS and you'll be royalty. Like the, it's more like, you know, it's like Shema, then we'll give you Gedula, what the Christians were saying. So, so I was like very confused. I was like, you guys, what MS? Like, you guys don't even know what's five times five. <laughs> what do you got? What, mathematics? What MS do you got? <laughs> I was so like, I was looking at it, there was like such a chiddush, it was such a novelty.